had to control everything. I had to control it from beginning to end. I had to be able to manipulate it. I was having a hard time moving forward. Um, I was um, paralyzed by a lot of fears. I was going through the motions as a Christian, but not being the Christian. The real Denise had some ugliness in her, some things about myself that I didn't even want to know because I'd buried so deep. A lot of people have the misconception now that it's a drug and alcohol program and uh, that's where those people go. It's so much more than that. The people that come through Celebrate Recovery, the majority of them are Christian. They love the Lord, but they don't know how to handle these hurts, these bad habits and hang-ups. I still had pride issues. I was still a people pleaser. I still was more concerned with what other people may think in opposed to what God would do. In the past, I've struggled with many different types of sin. Anger, codependency, looking at the wrong thing on the internet. Self-abuse, cutting, it could be self-hatred. Um, eating disorders is huge. We have times in our life where we feel out of control. Is there any hope for me? Or is this it? Is this as good as it's gonna get? The Celebrate Recovery meeting is where I really feel that I get spiritually connected. Because I know I'm entering into a place where there's no judgment. You work on whatever those hurt habits and hang-ups that you may have, you have a chance to work on them in, a, in an isolated situation. We've seen people who came in that were so broken, so down, so hurt, and to watch the transformation is just remarkable. You're here because God has led you here. And the message he wants you to receive tonight has everything to do with the hope that he wants to put in your heart. I had all these walls up. I wasn't letting anyone in. I was fearful. The Lord just surrounded me with a small group of people that would not stop loving me. And it was different for me, but I allowed it. That hole in my heart was being filled with something pure and holy. I'll never, ever forget that. And slowly but surely over this four year period, I have worked on my spiritual principles. The things that allow me today to be a better person, a better father, a better husband. What Celebrate Recovery allowed me to do is deal with that person in the mirror and become the type of Christian that God wanted me to become. We know for a fact you can have victory because we're experiencing it ourselves every day. So God wants us to celebrate the recovery that we have through our risen Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah.